everyone, welcome to web for tech Today I'll be going over the 7.1 Nougat update on the OnePlus 3T. So let's begin. OnePlus began to roll out the incremental update for OnePlus 3 and the OnePlus 3T on Thursday. It is known as the Oxygen OS 4.10 and 7.1.1 for Android. So let's take a look at the quick overview, what they did, and what I've been seeing since I used it for three days. Mainly when I first updated from 7.0 to 7.1, I saw the DPI change a lot. That's something I liked. On 7.0 Nougat, the DPI was like a little messy. The icons were too big and it was not clean, like it would not, as these icons will like be messy and would not fit properly. Like when I did the upgrade and saw this on 7.1, I was impressed, like it's such organized, such clean, and everything's like perfect. Like it's much simpler to use compared to the 7.0 update. The second thing they did focus on is the connectivity issues with their Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth. People that had the 7.0 update, they were complaining and giving feedback to OnePlus regarding the Wi-Fi being disconnected and randomly like connecting and disconnecting at times. So they would have to reboot their device and like force restart or something like that to make it work. Since three days, there's no issue for me. It's working properly. And as of now, like I have not witnessed any reboots or force close or any of those stuff with Wi-Fi or even Bluetooth. When I go to my car, my Bluetooth is on and it would automatically connect to my device. So I haven't seen any connectivity issues with my Bluetooth or the Wi-Fi. And that was their main focus in the 7.1 update. The other thing they noticed is the general fixes. So they have the backend fixes for it. And they did update the security for Google's patches. So as you can see, it's the latest version from the March. And as you can see, 4.1.0 on Oxygen. Build member is different. Kernel patches were fixed also. Uh, there was no change as I know on the baseband version. It's same as the 7.0 one. And other than that, last thing they mainly focused is on the camera. So I would show you a sample right now. Lastly, the update 7.1 for the OnePlus 3T brought a lot of features and a lot of reduction for blur in their picture taking. So OnePlus said when you take moving object pictures, the blur will, the blur will reduce. So let's take a look at it. So I'm moving the object, the watch, and I'm going to take a picture. So this is something they said got improved in the 7.1 update. So let's take a look. Yeah, as you can see, like I've been moving it, the blur reduction is less compared to the 7.0 update. See, the pictures are coming clear. I've been moving it and yeah, it definitely did do a lot of improvement to the blur reduction on the camera. And lastly, they did say when you switch to camera, the stability is like much better. So like when I'm recording, oh, that's, ha, that's taking a snapshot. So let me go to the camera and do the video stability. So it is on video now. And they said it's much stable to record the video. So as you can see, I'm doing the video. Yeah, I feel a little much difference. Not a lot of difference, but I do feel a bit difference. So that's all they focused on this update and they, they said in their release notes. Other than that, I find it a little bit much smoother, like bit difference compared to the 7.0 Nougat update. And I find the battery life slightly increased. Like I would get a little slight increase on the screen on time and the overall battery for the whole day. So if you haven't gotten the update, I think they are doing a global update. So they would go slowly from countries to countries. So just wait for that and then keep checking your update in the setting and then keep checking for the update here. They said they will release it slowly over the air. So you would get it within the next week or so. So other than that, this is really clean and nice update for OnePlus and the Oxygen OS. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment and leave your suggestion. Thank you.